Hello, I'm Dr. Franco, Medical Director of the Arthritis Center of Riverside. Um, I have been treating patients with rheumatic diseases for over 30 years. As I mentioned before, rheumatic diseases are multiple. One of these diseases is chronic fatigue syndrome. Patients with chronic fatigue syndrome have fibromyalgia, including the symptoms that I mentioned, and they also have, as the name states it, chronic fatigue, long-standing and sometimes very severe fatigue. It has been found by ourselves and other investigators that chronic fatigue patients have evidence of have had in the past or persistent Epstein-Barr EB virus infection or cytomegalovirus CMV infection or human herpes virus 6 infection. This is a different virus. It's not the genital virus. It's not the labial virus. It's one that causes mononucleosis and chronic fatigue syndrome. In addition to these viral infections, our patients have had mycoplasma infection as well, frequently. So what we do in some of our patients, we treat them with antibiotics and we try to boost their immune system or give them natural antivirals such as transfer factor. Well, chronic fatigue syndrome is one that can cause disability because patients, if they're very fatigued and they cannot think properly, they can't work well, therefore they lose their jobs. So in order to avoid patients from losing their job, they have to keep their health. In other words, fibromyalgia patients have to regain their health and they need adequate treatment. There is appropriate treatment and sometimes it can produce significant improvement and they can continue with their lives.